A big moment on the gridiron for a local high school player. What appeared to be just a simple play held special meaning. 10 Sports reporter Eric Johnson explains why his touchdown touched the lives of many in the Buena Vista community. On paper, it was just another regular high school football game for Perry McClure battling district foe Bath County. But for sophomore Landon Catlett, it proved to be an unforgettable night. You can hear it on the video. One of my best friends, Aaron Pruitt, he said, score a touchdown. Oh, a touchdown. And then as soon as I scored, I just thought about my dad and how he had coached me from when I was a little kid all the way through high school. 25 years ago, his dad, Eric Catlett, was in a similar scenario, a shining moment on the gridiron, kicking the game-winning field goal for the Blues against Rockbridge County. <laughs> the then multi-sport athlete would go on to instill athletics not only in his son Landon, making me dribble three balls in the basement on Sunday morning. But the community as well, including the likes of Evan James Cook. Growing up, I say everybody just wanted to be like Eric. He was a nice dude. He really helped everybody out. He was actually our coach that year. We didn't win a game. And he was always motivational, you know, always made sure we were playing our hardest no matter what the scoreboard was. And he's really like one of the reasons I fell in love with football. He was often described as the ultimate family man and life of the party. <laughs> As an avid fisherman, he even found light on the days that the fish weren't biting. No fish. Please. He was always wide open. It was, a never, it was never a dull moment when he was at home. Eric's infectious spirit touched all whom he came in contact with, which is why the community continues to grieve the loss of a husband, father, and mentor after blood clots reached his lungs and heart following an auto accident earlier this year. When you first heard the news, what was what was your reaction? I was heartbroken. I don't even know how to describe the feeling. It was just a piece of my heart kind of like fell off. Evan was one of the first teammates to reach out to Landon after the tragic loss, saying it's not only what he wanted to do, but rather what he needed to do. It's just really my job to be there as a as a best friend or slash brother. That's just really our relationship. We always there when each other needs each other. We got each other for advice. Playing with heavy hearts, Landon and his teammates have continued to suit up with an unexpected added touch. That's a 15. Carolina Blue. When you first saw it, what was, what was that like? You taking the field and you seeing all those white helmets. It just showed that like the football team really cares for me. The community is there for me. With unwavering support, Landon keeps in mind a simple motto his dad would always say. Do what you can while you can. And with that comes moments like this. I got to do it for him and that I wouldn't be this good if, if it wasn't for him.